The American West is a mother load of legends and stories, of friendship and courage, a romantic and exciting time to be remembered. Travel along with the old cowboy as he shares stories, poems, and music about the American West. Now, here he is, the old cowboy, J.C. Holsey. Howdy, folks. I'm the old cowboy. Grab a cup of joe and settle in for some good old-fashioned cowboy fun. As usual, before we start and get serious, well, what am I talking about? This is serious, at least to me. I got a couple of things I need to get off my chest, so here goes. We've lived here in this house for over 35 years, and our house has always been a place where stray cats come to the back porch to eat. There have been many that just passed through, but there have been some that became part of the Hulsey household. Recently, a beautiful tiger-colored tomcat kept coming around, sometimes staying for days. My wife and I figured if he was going to stay around, he needed that dreaded trip to the vet. It was extremely hard to get him into the carrier for the trip. I still got scars after that experience. However, we did get him in it and carried him to the vet, at the tune of $160 and some change. When we brought him home, we kept him inside so he wouldn't wander off. He became so loud that he was eventually left outside. He didn't return for a few days. <laughs> well, I don't think he liked especially me very much. However, he did return and stayed outside for a few more days. The length of time he was gone got to be longer and longer. Today he returned with a red collar around his neck. Now here's my question. Should I try to see who put the red collar on him and ask to be reimbursed for the vet bill? On a sadder note, one of the cats that decided to live with us and became the one to sleep with her little paws in my hand every night disappeared in October 2016. I hate to think of what might have happened to her. You see, my neighbor has a junky backyard, tall grass, junk, filled with all sorts of varmints, and one that's extremely dangerous, a bobcat. I've called a city and complained, but to no avail. I just hope that no other cats disappear. I've enjoyed traveling this trail with you today, and I want to invite you to come back next week. This is the old cowboy saying adios and happy trails. Come on back next week with the old cowboy J.C. Holsey.